What's going on guys? Um, Saturday evening, uh, May 21st, it's the night before the tournament for uh, the Yakabass Tracy Oasis tournament on the California Delta. Right now I'm just doing some uh, tackle prep, just getting all my rods and reels ready, getting all my uh, gear organized so that there's little stress as possible for tomorrow morning and went out on the water. So I, I pre-fished this uh, location where the tournament will be held a couple, couple times and I found uh, some pretty productive water. I just wanted to go over one thing real quick um, as, to far, as far as what I'm planning on doing tomorrow. Um, I plan on throwing the frog a lot, okay? And uh, what I found in practice um, is that the frog bite um, was when the tide was a little bit higher and it was good if it was an outgoing tide, uh, but specifically getting the frog into areas that were hard to access with a cast. So right up against the bank in little pockets, whether it be under a tree limb or a bush, um, just finding little current breaks along the bank. And it usually was around channel or river bends too. So those are just some of the areas, just kind of in a nutshell, that I found to be productive and what I plan on hitting tomorrow. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys the setup that I use uh, to make really pinpoint casts uh, for the frog, and I highly recommend this setup for kayak anglers. Uh, this is a Denali Lithium series rod. It's a 610 frog rod, and what I really like about this rod is the shorter handle. Okay, you know, when you're casting this thing, you don't have a big rod butt going into your side, and from a kayak and a lower vantage point, I think it's crucial to have that kind of control and accuracy, uh, especially for me tomorrow when I need to make those pinpoint casts with this frog. Yeah, this is going to be hopefully my workhorse tomorrow. I'm going to predict that tomorrow, you know, between three fish, it's going to take six, over 60 inches to win. But I think the frog has a high potential for, for doing that. So we'll see what happens. Off on the same spot. Hey man, you care if I fish behind you? I do not lose this many fish in the shop.
needed that one, guys. We needed that one. <laughs> Nice fish. It's fatter than it is long for sure. It's probably a nice four and a half. Whatever, we'll take it. My goodness, that was a good one. Got my net too early. That was my mistake. That makes up for things. That really makes up for things. That's, that's a great fish. These fish are fat. Another like four and a half pounder. Only 20 inches. But hey, we'll take her. Weird. <laughs> I think that's how you know they want the frog. Yeah. Nice little guy. Not gonna call anything. 